Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check your incognito history in Safari. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, there are a couple of different options you have. The first one is to just open up the Safari browser here. And you'll see I'm in incognito mode because where it says google.com, it is all grayed out. So you can see one option here potentially is you haven't closed out the, the tabs. Now incognito mode doesn't keep track of that history, but if you tap on the two squares at the bottom right, you can potentially go to different tabs and see the history that way if you haven't closed out of any of those tabs. Another option you have, it's, let's hop out of here and open up your settings. And you can just scroll down and tap on Safari here. And again, scroll down until you get to advanced at the very bottom. Now at the top, it says website data. Let's tap on that and it'll show you all of your website data, including any websites that you visited while you were in incognito mode. However, this doesn't show you sort of a um, uh, chronographic or uh, chronological order. It just shows you which websites have used the most data. To find out more information, you can go back and back again and back again. And we will tap on your Wi-Fi. And then right next to your Wi-Fi name, let's tap on the little I. And we're going to copy this router IP address. So tap and hold and hit copy. Because if we use this, we'll be able to see the entire history. So open up web web browser and we will just paste in this router IP address. And it will look different for every specific person. You can see I have AT&T fiber internet. Depending on what internet you have and what router you have, it will look different. But basically from here, you're just gonna look for the logs. So once you find the logs, it will show you exactly every single website that your router has visited, whether it's in incognito mode or not. I hope this helps. If it did, please consider subscribing down below and I'll catch you on the next one.